Breast cancer treatment may include many steps that carry a long list of side effects, but now one Glendale doctor has developed a one and done procedure. That doctor predicts that this could uh, soon become the standard of care for women with early stage breast cancer. And Circle of Health reporter Denise Dador shares the story of one local patient. Months before her 40th birthday, Mary Borjas felt an unusual lump on her breast. I always describe it as like half of a bean, like wanting to pop out, like sticking out. Getting a diagnosis would prove to be challenging. It took me two months to get a mammogram because doctors would say, it's okay, you're not 40 yet. You can wait three months to get a mammogram until you're 40. Mary faced even more obstacles getting treatment. Like many patients, she was told it would require surgery and up to six weeks of radiation. Dr. Dennis Holmes at Adventist Health Glendale offered Mary another option, intraoperative radiation therapy. Where the radiation is given entirely in a single dose while the patient is in the operating room. So when they leave the operating room, they're done with breast cancer surgery, they're done with radiation, and there's no further need for radiotherapy. Dr. Holmes helped pioneer the procedure. He says several weeks of radiation is often difficult for working patients, especially those with children. The burden of the treatment, the burden of the travel that's often involved, is often a barrier to patients either initiating or completing the treatment. Dr. Holmes says studies show 30 minutes of targeted radiation at the time of surgery is equally effective as weeks of radiotherapy afterwards. It also carries less side effects. There's less radiation treatment uh, effects on the heart, the less radiation treatment effects on the lungs. Candidates for intraoperative radiotherapy are those with stage one and early stage two breast cancer, which is about 70% of patients Dr. Holmes sees. Nine days after her procedure, Mary is grateful and recovering well. With this doctor, it's not what I expected. It's way less. I cannot be any more thankful. Um, I can't describe. I will bless him and